Hello? Hello? Okay, you should be about the same as me now. Okay, brilliant. This sounds good. All right. right. Game one, Jimbits, Saku. Mario versus Terry. Uh, this matchup's kind of wild. And yeah, it seems like it. Terry's yeah. like, both of them like to scrap. Yeah, both of them, I mean, I would say Mario's disadvantage is better than Terry's. Um, yeah. Mario kind of goes crazy in advantage too, which Terry's not going to enjoy. Mm -hmm. But Terry kills easier, arguably. Absolutely. When he gets that go meter, yeah. everything's it's, on the cards. He's actually just saying go home to the other player. That's <laughs> what he's saying. Let's go! <laughs> <laughs> yeah, Ma Mario actually likes go, seemingly okay. enough. And Saku so far with the lead. Um, yep. Also, really good. Oh, Saku beat our number two seed. I was wondering how... From 10th seed, he got to quarterfinals. That's how... Oh, uh, semis. Yeah, yeah. That's how. Very impressive wow, stuff. Yeah, very. Um, to be fair, a good Terry can beat anyone. That's I genuinely believe that. Um, because I, he's just sourcing. Except for maybe MKLeo, but you know. True, true. <laughs> I think Terry's the second best out of the FGC. Because who's your best? You think Kazi is best? I think Terry's best, and then Kazi is second, but... They're, they're both pretty close. Yeah. I just think... Even though Kazi's strengths are better, I think Kazi's disadvantage is enough worse that it True. Yeah, counterbalances. Lack of side B and up B options to recover. Just, yeah. yeah, okay. And the charge rising taco <laughs> going to be uh, the first stock. You, being a Lincoln lad, did you get to play against Ark much? Yes, I did quite a lot, actually. The um, the Ark matchup is different to the Terry matchup. Yeah. It's I very... Terry, like, as a character, is a lot of safe aerials that can be cancelled into specials stuff like that yeah Arc. Terry frustrates you into rolling in and then exactly. hit you with auto turn around down tilt <laughs> exactly and like Terry what well, all the FGC do this where yeah. they like allow you to cross Ooh, up their shield SDR. and then say no you don't get cross up the shield I no <laughs> yeah um because I played Ark in Lincoln mm -hmm. game one was absolutely horrendously dreadful I probably did about 20% the whole game yeah um but That's I just remembered it's Terry and threw Razor Leaf and it was exactly. fine. That's what happens. Um, as soon as you like learn that matchup, it gets a lot better. But right here, we've got Jim Bits off stage. Yeah. Saku, once again, on a healthy percent. I mean, the thing that's scary is, like, winning neutral versus Terry can be super hard. And it, if you can't figure it out, or in my case, because I can't figure it out, if you don't have a good projectile, what do you do? Because yeah. Jim has fireball, sure. But Terry's fine with you throwing fireball out, honestly. Nice use of fireball to be reverse, but gets hit by the up smash. <laughs> <laughs> Rosa, you're you're really funny. Punish and power dog. <laughs> oh, nice job. Oh block. yeah, great job, Lock. Yeah, Terry off stage. Let's see if anything can. Ooh. Oh, now using the up B to hit. Yeah. The ball foot. Y using the charge one, which is more hits than the yeah, uncharged. Yeah. And um, maybe Jim wasn't ready for that because he shielded most of it and then dropped at the end. Oh, Ooh. the jab, jab, Go side B. Are right you now. okay? Bust power. a nut. Ooh. Oh, nice spot dodge. Oh my god. So. Wow. The wow. spot dodge cancelled attack, yeah. had invincibility, which dodged Jim's up smash, and yeah. then he just went jab, jab, die. Yeah. And then <laughs> game one going to Saku. I that mean, was... coming in at 10th seed, he was one player that we all agreed we could be very wrong about a seed, but yeah. we we just seeded him this way. Because yeah. I'm fairly sure. That, yeah, Saku's the Manchester player, so. Right. Manchester's a super strong weekly. Yeah. Um. You know, getting maybe, for example, ninth at Manchester can still be hella hard. Yeah. Um, but he's doing sick right now. Um, coming from 10th seed, looking poised, if he wins this next game, to move into winners' finals. Is this still best of three? Best of three, yeah. Yeah, so, yeah, this could be it. But obviously, Jim Bits is a seasoned Mario. Oh, he's going to current. Okay. <laughs> Ignore what I just said. He's a seasoned Mario. Um, but I mean,. The Corrin is just as good. I've yeah, heard. Jim's Corrin's very good. Mm -hmm. Um, I I do prefer his Mario, but it's this is a character that MK Leo has a lot of faith in. Yeah, and for some reason. To be fair, the disadvantage, like the advantage state of Corrin, can go crazy. Yeah, it's especially you make one read and they die. Exactly. <laughs> With the Dragon Fang charge shot. Oh, it kills baby. At like yeah. fifty. Um, anyway, if we get into here, even percentages, Terry gets the down turn to the. What's it called? The move. <laughs> Burn a <laughs> knuckle. Yeah. Okay, Jim juggling, juggling which is... massive up there. Ooh. 
we we were saying how disadvantage is Terry's weakness. Mm -hmm. Okay, and the pivot side B, go meter is on deck. This is the first time we've seen Saku behind, but with go meter, yeah. which is scary. <laughs> yeah, the thing with Terry is like when you lose to Terry, it's like oh, when you oh, lead nice against pin. Terry, you've got to take the stock because yeah. well yeah, Jim did it. He he showed he's the goat. He's the goat with the sauce. The Terry Ooh. matchup is very much about like trying to take that stock a lot earlier than any other character. Yeah, you just need to take the stock before they get a single go move out, and then you're kind exactly. of okay. Um, Jim with the forward smash on Saku here. Saku makes it back down to the ground. He's got him Jim bits off stage. Jim bits fights his way back on with a pin. Nice taking to the stage. Okay, Saku's just power dunking. I like um. That jump power dunk that Saku's doing, mm -hmm. it almost auto cancels. As far as I know, yeah, specials yes. can't auto cancel, but the lag just ends right yeah, before yeah, he touches yeah. the ground, power and dunk. then he's fine. Yeah. Yeah, power dunk is one of the insane moves. The fact that you can just finish it very quickly if you do it from a certain yeah. height. But Jim, complete reversal from the last game. Two stocks up right now versus Saku. Did, oh, did nice try and power? punish the oh, power dunk there, which can't happen, but he's. He's moving a little bit. Yeah, I'm not gonna lie. He's doing a lot better. He's keeping it, it, it Saku in disadvantage a lot more, and like trying to push that advantage state, which is what you need to do against Terry. Yeah, yeah. Something Raza pointed out is like, so the reason that it's plus on shield is because when Terry does the special input power dunk, the lag ends almost right when the hitbox ends. Yeah. So if you get the right height, so that your hitbox ends right as you land on their shield, they, it's literally plus, like what do you do? So Saku's taking his way back onto the board right now, got a stock. Oh, oh, what a counter! He's at 90 after the hit! <laughs> Current counter is absolutely insane! That's reminiscent of Smash 4. I mean, <laughs> the funny thing is, I didn't even play Smash 4 and that's reminiscent of Smash 4 of me. I have heard many stories. It killed zero. Yeah, about the, the legendary car encounter. Yeah. So game three right game now. Game three, yeah. What one one. Going straight to Smashville. Okay, they they knew what they wanted to ban. <laughs> I agree with Rosa's sentiment in the chat. Oh, he just kinda died. It's true. It's very true. Yeah. Um sticking with this matchup, Jim looked super confident, I'm not gonna lie that last game. Yeah. But sometimes you have one game, you're not sure what you're doing, you start a new one and you just play Patient, you, you, Especially you think with about a, it, yeah. With a player like Jim Bits, he's likely to change up his gameplay based around the character. Yeah. So, like, having to deal with the new habits or the new yeah, yeah. ways that he uses his character's, like, mobility, it's, it's very hard for Saku. Yeah. And he, he will. He's, he's just using these aerials really well. Yeah. Whether it's forward air or up air, they both start above Karin. So, he's just kind of spacing it there to stop Saku landing in front of him. So, as we can see now, Saku's, like, taking Ooh. the advantage state. Oh. But Jim Bits has just fought his way out, getting a falling off there. Jim Bits just chomping on him. Okay, Down no back air coming out there, and gonna eat a punish as a result. This is, this is fairly pretty even right now. Yeah, jab, well, jab, boom, all it takes is something like way. that. <laughs> and gets Saku, a roll read out. Yeah, and yeah. takes the stock for it. Saku this time the one with the lead. Jab, jab, power dunk, 27% already on Jim. What extra credit can Saku get? The scariest part about extra credit with Terry is, so you're trying to make the comeback, you're trying to get rid of his stock before he kill, uh, gets enough extra credit. Yeah. On the way to taking his stock, you're probably going to give him go, go meter. Yep. And then he's just going to go, I got rage, I got go. I'm going to kill you at 60. Wolf. Yeah. <laughs> um, I mean, we did see Jim kill at even less percent than that with counter last game. But so I, he can't be too upset, yeah. but oh, that was him. not the correct EI, but Saku's going to live anyway. Oh, good point, drop on the yeah, pin there this, from Jim. Yeah, at this point, like, just resetting neutral was the better idea. He Absolutely. Didn't to, he didn't want to fall into anything like that. Death smash. Yeah. <laughs> because the go moves have super armor, you do want to reset neutral. Any yeah. chance that you're like, maybe I could get a reversal here, it isn't worth it. Yeah. Trust me, it's not. Yeah. <laughs> you just need to reset yeah. and throw Razor Leaf. That's just what you need to exactly. do. Exactly. Guess that'll pay off stage to take this stock. So we're on two stock apiece right now. But there's a massive percentage lead. Okay, Burn Knuckle once again, down tilt into Burn Knuckle and Seal. Saku's got the shield mix up, which I like. The one thing I'd like to see a bit more of is, you see Terry's do a couple of down tilts into a grab on shield, yeah. which you're so scared of dropping shield because of power dunk. It works <laughs> yeah. very consistently. Okay, going for the rise and power dunk there. Jab, 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 power dunk. Gonna not take oh, it not just yet. Yeah. Right. 
but Jim is it's sitting pretty at 136 percent here. Not even sim. Oh, the counter, counter again. Oh, doesn't quite kill this time. Right? Yeah, <laughs> a, a similar kind of uppercut move like Terry's up smash, but not the same knockback. So not going to kill just yet. Oh, oh, power knocking the other way and was able to shield and dash attack. Wow, brilliant! He recognized that he was hitting the shield, so he was like, "I'm going to get away from this." Yeah. And uh, now Saku, only on 56%, already going to work on lapping Jim and percent the stock. This is looking very good for yes. Saku right now. Very dominant. He's made the changes from game two. Yeah. The thing with Corrin, Corrin's very solid when her game plan's working and neutral's working. But making a comeback is not her forte. Exactly. And look at this right now. 96% on Jim. Saku's poised to take the game and the set right now. Oh, Jim Bits got an in disadvantage. Here we go. Side beyond to the stage. Oh, and the oh. burning knuckle calling out the ledge hop and Saku. Nice one. Two stock game three after getting pretty much humble game game yeah. two. Very <laughs> solid. It was a very solid performance from Jim. Absolutely. Um,